It's time to test the battery life of iPhone XR, iPhone 11, 12, 13 and 14 after the latest iOS 17.4.1. What's up guys, this is Mehran and today we are diving deep into the world of smartphone battery life. With the release of iOS 17.4.1, the stacks have never been higher. Now there is one reason why this battery test is important in 2024. So this test helps users make an informed decision about which iPhone model can best meet their specific battery life needs in ever connected world. So if you are thinking to get the iPhone 10 R 11, 12, 13 or even the iPhone 14 in 2024 but worried about its battery life, so stay with us as we are about to unveil the average battery life of these iPhone models. If you are a gamer or just a social user, this video is definitely gonna clear all your confusion. So without wasting any time, let me introduce Wondershare Mobile Trans. If you are switching from Android to iOS or iOS to Android but worried about your important data, then no worries as the Wondershare Mobile Trans has got you covered. By using this application, you can transfer all your data from Android to iOS without a computer as well. So just simply download Mobile Trans from its official site if you have an access to a computer and simply install it to your desktop. By using mobile trans on your computer, you will have access to transfer line GB WhatsApp kick, Viber and WeChat data from Android to iOS or iOS to Android as well, which is very simple. Just connect your both devices to the computer, select any of app from which you want to transfer your data between these devices. You can transfer photos, videos, contacts, messages between them. So click on start button, you will get some instructions, so follow them which doesn't require any technical knowledge. If you don't have a computer, you can use mobile version as well, which is available in Google Play Store and App Store. Just simply install mobile trans on your old and new device, open the application on both sides and you will get all the features. For example, if you are transferring data from Android to iOS or iOS to Android, just use the phone to phone feature, select the file which you want to transfer, then scan the QR code from the Android if you are transferring data from Android to iOS and after that your data will be transferred within few minutes. After using the mobile trans, you wouldn't need to worry about your important data while switching your device. I'm mentioning the download link in the description, just let me know if you guys have got any questions regarding mobile trans application. Now let's get back to work, the bright is hit to almost 50% and the volume is around 10% we are using the Wi-Fi network as they are SIM free and all of them are also running on the latest iOS 17.4.1 version. Now as usual, we are going to be testing each of the applications including PUBG, TikTok, Asphalt 9 and some social application as well. The battery health plays an important role so I will reveal that as well at the end of this video. Now enjoy the music and let's find out which iPhone will last longer in 2024.
Welcome back after a quick battery drain test in 2024. Now let's reveal the battery health of each iPhone and see how did they perform. So the iPhone XR were first to die with 91% battery health. We got 5.5 hour which is not bad in my opinion as we did some heavy activities within these 5 hours. So I'm appreciating this iPhone model even after 5 years you will get around 5 to 6 hours screen time on the iPhone now the iphone 11 ended up in 6 hours and 15 minutes with 88 percent battery health and this is the reason if you are getting these old iphone models just make sure the battery health should be around 85 percent or more if you really want your iphone to last longer and one more thing the ios 17.4.1 looks quite good in terms of battery life so far the iphone 12 also performed very well as we have got six and a half hour screen time with heavy usage the battery health is 100% because this is a furbished one so 6.5 hour battery life is quite good for the iPhone 12. If you are thinking to get refurbished iPhone 12 with 100% battery health then it's definitely worth buying in 2024. The iPhone 13 performed slightly better than the iPhone 14 as we have 91% battery health on this one and give up it's 7.5 hour which is slightly better then the iPhone 14 battery life as the iPhone 13 is still better and to be very honest I am recommending the iPhone 13 instead of iPhone 14 in 2024 because they are quite similar so just save some money if you want just make sure the battery health should be around 90% if you are thinking to get one and last but not the least the iPhone 14 ended up with 7 hours and 25 minutes with 89% battery health so if you are getting the iPhone 14 with around 90% battery health then this is what you expect from its battery life now at the end it should be clear to everyone regarding this battery test if you are just a social user then all these iphone models can last a single day from the morning till evening especially the iphone 10 r and 11 which will definitely require some charging while the iphone 12 13 and 14 will stay awake till the night just make sure to hit that like and subscribe button also share this video with your friends and i would like to hear your opinions in the comment section down below thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next one